I do believe that we need to cut down the amount of people that GSU answer to. Because as is right now, GSU answer to the divisional commander, the answer to Eastern Division commander, the answer to commander operations, and the answer to commissioner of police. So too much people they have to answer to. And uh, the, the, the reputation of GSU and uh, what they can do, it is important that we minimize the amount of persons who can deploy GSU, especially to a volatile situation like what was happening at port. And so my directive is now that once there is any civil disobedience or any situation of a sensitive nature, the only person who will deploy GSU will be the commissioner of police, nobody else. So if the commander of GSU were to get a directive from anybody below the commissioner to be deployed, the commander of GSU will have a responsibility to call the commissioner and ask if the commissioner have given such directive, just to ensure that they are on the safe side. Now we expect that with Mr. Joseph coming in as the new commander of GSU, you all know Yao Zhou, a very humble fella. Um, well, you have a wealth of experience in training. And so we believe that him going to the GSU will be able to somewhat change the perception of GSU because, you know, people tend to have a bitter taste in the mouth when they hear the name GSU or the acronym GSU. But we have to understand that as much as, yes, what happened out there is one that is distasteful to all of us, that the GSU have done a lot of good work as well.